Now that summer is almost here, bearing it all requires the most arduous of beauty duties, hair removal. So Trudy's here to um, share what are the best ways to Shed do it. Shed some light. Shed, oh, boom. <laughs> boom, boom, enough. <laughs> all right, so what are the options for hair removal? You've got quite a few. I mean, obviously there's the DIY, the creams and the shaving, and there's also gadgets now, but there's also um, salon services like IPL and laser that actually do a great job of removing unwanted hair. I have to say, um, at home waxing never worked for no, me. No, no. There are some things that you have to go to a professional yeah. for, and I think waxing is one of them. Yeah, definitely. Um, you know, like just a little bit of downy hair might be okay with those strips, but a big job like the Ouch. bikini line, you need to get. You need to seek professional. But well, there are certain areas that you can't get to. <laughs> hey. So um, let's talk about IPL, um, laser treatment. What is it and who can have it? Well, it's intense pulse light. And basically it's visible light that is attracted to the pigment in the hair and it travels down the pigment of the hair and destroys the hair at the follicle. And after a few days, the hair falls out. So it's, it's simple. It's not pain free, I've got to say. Um, if I've had it, it's it, not. It's not yeah. pain free, but it is a more permanent solution to unwanted hair. In saying that, it's not permanent. No hair removal. I mean, when there is one that is permanent, the person that um, actually develops it will be very wealthy. There is no permanent solution. Now, it's not for everyone, is it, IPL? No. Um, you need to have fair skin with mm. dark hair. The reason being, because it is all about the light being attracted to pigment, if you've got very dark skin, then it will actually work on the skin and right. the hair. So it can cause burning and it can cause issues like scarring. So you do need a consultation. And, you know, I always, I'm horrified when I see grab ones for you know cheap deals on hair removal you need to go to a professional person who understands hair removal with a correct laser machine who has got a registered laser machine because there's a lot of me too laser yeah. machines out there that don't work that don't work yeah so you really do if you're investing that sort of money you really need to make sure you do your homework and you can get burnt too. you can get yeah. burnt you can get scarring so you do need to be really careful yeah okay so um what are the other options well look there's waxing you've got some, <laughs> you've got some the, torture I've devices the home, here I've got the home kits here there's waxing which is awesome i think people have forgotten how good that is waxing actually as the hair is pulled ripped from your flesh which is also a painful experience <laughs> it does make the hair finer over yep. time so you have less hair it's finer it's easier to manage um, electrolysis is another great option which has been out of vogue for a long time but that essentially uses a probe or a little fine needle that goes into the follicle and kills the hair at the root okay is it painful Yes. Yes, okay. You know, <laughs> hair removal is not painless unless you're shaving. Um, but that's a goodie, because, and it's also satisfying because the um, operator actually removes the hair. The thing about laser is that you've still got the hair when you walk out the door, yep. but it, it does fall out a few days later. Um, shaving, um, you know, a silk apple is another option. You can cause okay, let's, yourself some let's, pain. Okay, let's talk about this, because I remember back in the... Uh, Whenever um, the epi lady, Look, Dawn, it's torturous. It, well, it's not as bad. I reckon you get used to the pain. You well, know, and because no, you're no, doing no, it yourself. No. Explain what it actually. Well, does. look, this silk apple is the new one from right. Dawn. Actually, they've just launched a bikini trimmer, which I couldn't get my hands on today. That's the most recent one. Look, this has got a sensor on it. Should I turn it on? Yeah, go for okay, it. Okay. So, shall we do it? Off? Shall we do it? No. Off? <laughs> no. <laughs> so basically, it passes over the skin, and it's like thousands of little tweezers and it pulls out the hair. The thing about this is that it removes very fine hair that you can't get with waxing. Oh, okay. So if you've had a wax and you've still got a bit of fine hair, you can run over the legs or any area like that with it. And it does, it works really well. Um, okay. And look, you know, just when you thought razors couldn't do anything more than have... How many blades? Five blades <laughs> and moisturising yep. strips. This um, intuition from Schick, it's called Fab, F-A-B. It actually works up and down. No way. Yeah, so if you're really lazy like me and you think oh I'm wearing a dress I need to shave my legs quick. quick smart and I'm super lazy yeah I mean I'm actually the most lazy person on the planet yeah this one goes up and down and it shaves up and down which I thought was a really good idea why have they not come up with that before I know why okay let's not? talk about your um, top tips for hair um, removal like okay. the best way of using all of this for a start don't use your husband's razor no. get your own because female razors are actually um, they've got a moisturizing strip on them which is much nicer for your skin also and your that's skin disgusting is, well yeah there's that 
But your skin is actually a bit more delicate than men's skin, yeah. so I think invest in your own razor. Um, if you're having IPL or waxing, don't self-tan before you go, because oh no. there will be self-tan in the hair follicle and you'll get those little brown attractive dots all over yeah. your legs. Um, avoid sparkles and things like that after waxing, shaving, just because the hair follicle is open. And oh, also, and the sun. With and IPL, the sun, eh? Yeah, the sun, you need to use a sunscreen with IPL. You know, it does expose your the top layer of your skin to the sun, so you need to, to do that. And I think, you know, with any hair removal, choose a modality that suits you. You know, yep. laser, when you look at it, it, the initial outlay is expensive, but it does get rid of about 70% of the hair. Okay. So, you know, if We've got to go, Trudy. If you, if you're, you're an IPL that, lover. I, I am an IPL it. lover. No. The right operator. <laughs> With the right one. Um, okay, yeah. for more beauty know-how, you can go to Trudy's website, beautyeq.co.nz. Thanks so much, Trudy.